Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my video. I am the power of man. I'm the time zone man. I'm always telling you I'm beaming bright. Now, um, I did some videos like some about some harassment I was facing in um, Jamaica, Queens. Now, which is still happening. Now, I'm gonna explain some things to you. It uh, it, that that like what baffled me for like couple years. Well, now in a rich country like this in America, right, where you go, if have you gone to the city and see how rich the cities are? Have you ever noticed how much um, uh, like houses in our neighborhood? Like I live in Hollis in Jamaica, Queens, and when you check all the houses here nobody don't really own all of them the banks own all of them right the the um the train the the, the chain that we um uh, have on and the bus them run by the same people on it. you understand now um i'm a poor black man that's what i tell myself and i was born in a poor family my father didn't make no preparation for me and my mother didn't make no preparation for me and even though they tell you to get an education, in some, in some, in some, um, like this angle or part of the world, like here, you could have a good education and you're still broke and don't have no money in your bank account. Point I'm trying to make is, if you're born in a poor family, you're supposed to try to make a change, right? But when you're born amongst giants that have control over everything, they don't want you to have nothing. No, so. I'm saying now I create a, a like a way for myself. Like I, I, I am I have like a businessman, so I, I engage into those kind of things. But when I realize you have to control over the people still have control over something to come your way or for you to receive it. Now with the post office, man, I complained to the post office for almost like five to seven years and the same thing over and over. I, mean, I keep having problems with them with the mails. And so they claim that they're sending me like uh, uh, checks and stuff like that. But I never received one in the mailbox. And not one ever come into this mailbox. They always stop it at the post office. And then they have come with some next thing before the mail reach me again. They will stop it again before they put it in the box. You understand? Now, so in a rich country like this, I don't think that's supposed to be happening to a person that born and never have nothing. You understand? And if you don't want to be a part of the 75% of black men in America, and you be like a black man that trying to like make a difference for yourself, yo, these people here, it's like they don't want to see that. It's like you're supposed to be working, working, and, and, and that's it. You know, you know, it's like you're not supposed to try to, to uplift yourself. But uh, this goes on for those people that with money and those people that didn't bond in riches. And the one who bond in riches, you, you, you know, we don't, we, who do not bond in riches, we see the world different. We're trying to be better for ourselves. We're not trying to be like, get rich like you. We don't like to be rich like you. But listen, man, we want to better ourselves. So I don't think you should come with no harassment. You know? Don't worry about if you get a five grand.